Hi everyone, in the previous video we have installed Selenium ID add-on for Firefox web browser. Actually after installation we can see it here on our Firefox web browser, so let's start customizing our Firefox web browser, I want for this Selenium ID to be more visible, so I'll put it to this main menu of Firefox web browser, and now I want to open it. Uh, the main usage of Selenium ID for Firefox is for recording uh, with that tool we can record or our our uh, work in our browser so everything what we are doing in our browser web browser we could record by using this selenium id and as you can see recording button is automatically on by default and uh, whatever we are doing this ID will record it uh, why uh, we are uh, why selenium ID recording those commands uh, it actually record commands uh, which uh, we can call selenies. Selenies are uh, commands that Selenium ID use for recording the history. After recording this history in web browser, you can execute your tests as you wish but first let's record some browsing with this tool i will hide it for now for example let's go to the website bing.com and let's search some term i don't know maybe albert einstein Let's go to Wikipedia. Let's maybe choose another language. I don't know, there are a lot of languages. Let's choose Danish language. And maybe let's click on some other link. For example, here. Okay. And that's it for now. Now let's back to Selenium ID. And as you can see, our browsing history is recorded this and saved in Selenium's commands. Uh, we can now start and play our current web browsing history as a test case because one of the purposes for uh, Selenium is to make uh, tests over the web. Uh, we, we've made currently just uh, one test, but you can also make a lot of other tests. And when you want to start them, if you want to start just one test, you will click this button and if you want to start all test cases you will click here but we for now just have one test which actually don't have name yet but let's start again our test and to see does it remember our history It's going automatically. Maybe it should be better if I made it to be 
little window and it needs maybe to go a little bit slowly. Let's run it again. Go to the Bing browser, Albert Einstein term, go to Wikipedia of Albert Einstein and find it on the Danish language and go to some other link, Mileva Maritz. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Happy te.